Hey G Squad, welcome back to episode of Is and Worth It. So for today's episode, we got this cool mineral right here. And basically what this is, is a water filter that you can use to place it. The Abrita water filter pitcher. And we see the one that we got right here, it comes in a pack of 10 of them. They do have this available in smaller or bigger packs. So depending on how many that you need, that is up to you guys. But regardless of which ones get, all of them work the same way. So you see right here, they mentioned how you probably want to change it every two months. And they probably got some of the benefit of using Pada. And we got to turn to the back, they also probably got some more information as well. And supposedly for this water filter, it should fit a lot of different pictures from the Brita brand. The one that I got is this one right here. We actually have the option for you guys to push a lid to pour it in, which is actually really convenient. But I'm actually open this up to show you guys what the inside looks like first. All right, so once you guys open up, there's a box inside the box. But once you guys take it out, there's basically two boxes in here and for each one of these packs, there's five of them. So five in this one and five in the other one. So once you guys open up, that is basically what the inside looks like. So you see how the pot is all nicely wrapped up inside so that way you know it's brand new. And they also probably got some instruction on here to teach you guys how to use it in terms of how often you can change it. And if it's your first time using pot, you do want to run it in water to let it kind of clean first before you guys drink the water. So once you guys open up, this is what the pot looks like inside. So this is where the water will go in. And right here is the bottom where the water will come out. And I love the way how they design the top part so that way you can carry around really easily. But all you need to do is just insert it into your water pitcher like this. It only fits one way. Once you guys got it in, they can pour the water inside and start using it. So once we do put it back inside, you're gonna close the lid. And it's all set to start using it. And the thing that I like about the Brita brand's water filter pitchers is the fact that they do have the little status indicator light to let you guys know when you guys need to replace it. And I really like the design of this one because it gives you guys the option to pour the water on top right here. So that way you don't have to take off the lid if you don't want to. So that is basically how you guys set up the water filter. Now I'm just going to go test out the product to show you guys how it works. And we'll come back and talk more product in a second. So once you guys got the filter in, they just pour the water inside. So you see the water is coming down in the bottom. So all you need to do is just wait for the water to kind of finish filtering. So very easy and very simple to use. Alright, welcome back guys. So next we'll quick test button definitely actually does work and actually works quite well. If you see the whole setup process and everything wasn't that hard, it was actually pretty easy. All you need to do is just pour the water on top and just let the water kind of go through. And like I mentioned, if it's the first time using Pala, you want to let it run a few times before you guys do drink the water. So that way you guys know the water is clean. But if you see from the actual test, the product definitely does work and actually works quite well. But that is basically everything that's on the product. Now to go unboxing and test the product. Now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth or not. So for this product, I do have to say that it is pretty worth it if you guys want to need one of these. Especially if you guys already own like a Brita water filter pitcher. Like the one that I show you guys right here or any other ones that are compatible with this filter. Then I do have to say that it is pretty worth it. <laughs> but then obviously with those you guys who don't want or don't need one or have one of these. Then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that actually do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys. So you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.